Hi everyone, thanks for tuning back in to Transformers Toys for Kids. I wanted to start by saying thank you to anyone who subscribed to this channel or even watches. It's now reached 10,000 subscribers. So thank you so much for tuning in every week to watch these videos. This week, I'm featuring RescueBot race cars and RescueBot airplanes. Let's get to it. Let's start with our RescueBot race cars. First we have Whirl. Let's park her in the back here. Next up we have Heat Wave. Followed by Hot Shot. After that we have Chase. And finally, we have two different Blur race cars. Get them transformed up so you can see how they compare. What do you notice is different about each of these race cars? There's a lot different. Their colors are different. All of their spoilers are different. The area where the driver sits is a different color and a different shape on each one. And here's something I noticed. You can still see their hands in their alt race car modes here. But Chase does a really nice job of hiding his hands and so does Blur. Let's take a quick look at them from their side view. If you notice, they all have different colors or designs for their rims. Some don't have any paint on their rims and some of them do. Chase is also very unique because he's not showing any front wheels, just the back ones. Start with Whirl. Pull back on the spoiler, that's how you transform every single one of these race cars. Her back here, let's get heat wave. There we go. And hot shot. Pops open great. Strong feet at the bottom. Chase sneaking in. Even though he looks a little different, transforms the same and looks pretty similar to them. And finally, the two blurs. Only difference being their colors. Get them lined up and see how they compare. Let's take a quick look at their head sculpts. The blurs are going to have the green glasses because of their rims being green as well. The world's got those yellow eyes. I really like Heat Wave's head sculpt, probably my favorite of the bunch. Let's move on to look at the Rescue Bot airplanes. Flying in first, it's stealth mode Bumblebee. How cool he looks. What I like about all these airplanes is they've got this little piece here that hides the head sculpt and then it moves into place when you transform them. So there's his head sculpt you can see hiding there. It's really cool. You can even move their hands forward in this mode. Well, that's a little weird. Kind of like a Superman pose as they're flying. More so for when they're in their robot mode. All right, let's put stealth mode Bumblebee back here. Next up we have Oro flying in. Very cool. Blades coming in from the right side. Who's next? Hot Shot! And finally, we have the other Bumblebee, just not in his stealth mode this time. They all look pretty similar. You'll notice some differences though. Either the size of the color of the propellers here, and then where the cockpit actually is. So the cockpits are on the front here. This one looks like a sleek modern design. And then this one, with Hotshot, it's actually in the back, which is very unique. And he has what looks like a front propeller on Hotshot. These are very small here and here. Now get them transformed up into their robot modes. Let's start with Bumblebee in the front. All you do is pull down on the front here, kind of snaps into place. And there, definitely Bumblebee. Again, you can move his arms up and down. If he's in his little fighting stance here, put him back down. All right, let's go with stealth mode Bumblebee. They all transform the same way. Well, I take it back, Hot Shot's a little bit different. Let's put them next to each other, right here and here, and bring Whirl in. Next is Blades. And then last but not least, we've got Hotshot, who transforms a little different. 
So he doesn't have that little piece that hides his head sculpt. You have to kind of rotate this piece down, which still leaves this piece back here like the others. And there's Hotshot, who can still move his arms as well. Let's take a quick look at their head sculpts. What differences can you spot when they're in their robot modes? I've noticed, of course, that their head sculpts are all different. But take a look at the design for the feet. They're different colors. And then this is more rounded, whereas this is more rectangular shape. These two have that, these two have the rounded ones, and then Hot Shots just completely different. What other differences do you see between these five airplanes? Well, that's all the time we have for today. I hope you enjoyed watching this video on rescue bots, airplanes, and race cars. Please tune in every week for more fun Transformers videos.